a generic searcher that interacts with attack points of zero, this isn't going to end well. Make sure you guys smash that button, crap out, subscribe button, so you guys don't miss out on more awesome content. So, Perry Ray's map. Hmm. So, uh, this is a normal spell card at the start of your main phase one. So, it's going to have to be the first thing that you're going to have to do. So, hey, no pot of extravagance. All right, that's fine. Add one monster with zero attack from your deck to your hand. And if you do, have your life points. Okay, sure. Also, you're going to activate the effects of cards with the same name as the added card until the end of the next turn after this card resolves or until you normal summon a monster with that name. Now, you're probably like, wait a minute, Rob, why are we making such a big deal out of a spell card that makes you half your life points and has to be played at the beginning of your main phase one? Well, my dear duelist, I was actually looking at this, and uh, did you know that this can search for rat peer? That means that the amount of starters that I can abuse in this day. Well, I mean, hey, it says normal summon. All right, we we you can search for rat man. You can do stuff with you bell. All right, which is going to be much slower on the back end of things. It, it searches for Venomanaga, but once again. Their effects are negated until you normal summon the monster or until the next turn, whichever applies first. Alright, I guess it also searches for True Exodia. You also search for Uriah, alright, but, I mean, you can put these higher level monsters on the field. Look, it searches for even Thunder Dragon, <laughs> you can search for Tyrant Neptune, but guess who's banned? Alright, like, at the end of the day here, even ser searches for Super Crash, but this thing has zero attack points. Alright, hey, this this one's also pretty good. And also search for gate zero. Uh, you already know what kind of fun interactivity you're going to get out of that. Uh, nobody cares about Royal Magic. Well, I guess like you could search for Royal... Actually, is this a support card for Exodia? Because you could technically search for the library, normal summon this, and then you should be good to go. Right? I guess you can also set Stray Lambs, but I mean, realistically, who's doing that? Oh, yeah, you can search all the Ojamas, too. All right, well, that would be... Uh, that would be fun time. You can search for Piper, but once again, like, a lot of these choices are gonna be, like, very passive. I just saw we passed the Mutant Monster, uh, Heretic Spheres, I guess, but, like, that stuff doesn't matter. You, the, the cool thing I thought about with this was, like, you search, search for the Ghost Girls, because they're all zero attack points, but once again, you have that stipulation if you can't apply the effect, so you're not gonna be able to do anything. I mean, you can also deploy, like, a Fog King or something off of this, you know, so it, it's... I think the best application for this is you... Oh, you can search for the eggs, but once again, it's not going to matter. All right, you can search for Ghost Girls for another passive turn. You can search for Rat Peer to start full combo. All right, you already know how good Zodiac is. You can search for Ubel, which is cool. But you can also search for Gate Zero, which means that not only are you going to have Dark Worm in there, you also get, like, another multi-layer of extenders for Pendulum. So that's something that you got to consider, like... Yeah, you pay half your life points, but it does give you a pendulum scale. All right, yeah, you could dedicate more of those resources to, you know, maybe more Dark Worm support, but having that universal gate zero searcher for half of your life isn't necessarily a bad thing at the end of the day. So I particularly thought this card was interesting just because of what it does. So what do you guys think? Please leave a comment down below to what you guys think. Smash it out of the subscribe button so you guys want to miss some more awesome content. And I'll see your beautiful faces back to you later on the day with some more cool awesome content. Peace out, guys. Thank you, patrons, for making the ride never truly end without you guys' support. Well, I would probably be doing troubleshooting videos for a living. Guys, please check out Vanquil 40 for all of your Cardway Vanguard content brought to you by Mcol 40 And if you were looking to pick up singles, check out mcolgames.com for your trading card game needs. Thanks for watching, everybody.